Good morning, everyone. My name is Amanda Prorock. I'm a faculty member in the Computer Science uh, and Technology Department, where I lead a team of researchers. We work on robotics and multi-robot systems. And I'm going to be talking about co-evolving built environments and mobile autonomy. So we're really at a turning point for mobility where we're seeing deeply transformational change, especially in urban environments where automated mobility will change the way we allocate space and it'll change the way we access mobility. However, the problem of creating automated mobility is very hard. So um, the question that we've been asking is how do we optimize a topography or a, an, the, an, the layout of a built environment such that the problem of path deconfliction, which is one of the most fundamental problems in planning paths for autonomous robots, is facilitated and more efficient? To do this, we've been looking at um, an area of theory called algebraic topology, where we designed a measure um, based on homology classes of trajectories that tells a robot or an autonomous vehicle how hard it is to plan a path from its current location to the goal that it wants to reach. And we coined or we, we, we defined this new metric, which we call path prospects. So you put robots into a very cluttered um, and tight environment. The problem that they have to solve now is how do they prioritize the, the right of way amongst each other. And using this metric, we were able to show that we were able to outperform other, all other benchmark algorithms in terms of make, span, and flow time, which is effectively quantifying how fast robots are able to reach other goals. At a higher level, we've tackled the problem of routing along transport networks that have uncertain travel times. So uncertainty is a very common problem because there are issues such as traffic conditions, jams, and accidents that lead to uncertain travel times, as well as uncertainty in robot positioning, so they don't always know exactly where they are. And of course, the more uncertain we ha uncertainty we have along the travel graphs, the, the transport networks, the more uh, performance we lose when we're applying our optimal assignment and routing algorithms. So this is the problem that we want to tackle. And so what we did is we came up with uh, an algorithm or an opti optimization algorithm based on submodular optimization that leverages coordination amongst the robots so that they can more effectively decide which robots go along which routes. It leverages an idea of a redundant network topology, of which the details I don't have time to go into now. But we were able to show that these coordinated systems um, are able to outperform a, a, um, benchmark algorithms in terms of both occupation ratio as well as um, reduced waiting times for passengers that are, or products that are waiting to be picked up. Another emerging property of our algorithm um, is that the paths planned by these algorithms tend to be much more diverse than other benchmark algorithms, and this is a naturally arising property from our submodular optimization algorithm. So in a nutshell, um, we work on redesigning the built environment so that robotic uh, path planning and navigation is more efficient and effective. The overall vision here is to design more resilient and future-proof, autonomy-supportive uh, built environments. And I thank you very much for your attention.